Hi there. Um, I've been meaning to make this video for a few days once I saw this article on Zero Hedge. Unconstitutional, tyrannical red flag gun confiscation laws are coming fast. Most surprising, however, is that Donald Trump has jumped on the bandwagon calling for red flag laws, among other egregious measures to deal with the recent spate of shootings in the United States. The response from Trump's base has been a mix of personality cult and virulent opposition, hinting that Trump, if he goes forward with the red flag proposal, could be shooting himself in the foot. <laughs> That's pretty dang funny. Um, what's the problem with red flag laws? Well, red flag laws are allegedly dis uh, devised to disarm individuals who may be at a high risk to commit violent acts before they do so. Folks, your siblings, your spouse, uh, medical health professional can go to a judge and say this person is unstable because I watched his YouTube videos about red flag laws and chemtrails and whatever and they come and they take your weapons and then you get to go to court. So it's the reverse of due process and people don't, a lot of people haven't seen that. I have a smart uh, person in my life who has a master's degree and it took a while for that to soak in that it was the opposite of due process. Um, so I'll, I'll link the article because I think it's important to read it. And it's kind of a little follow-up to the video I made a year ago or so. Um, oh, come on, computer. Sorry. Houston, we had a problem. Or shout out to the uh, ME community a little bit there. You know, the computer crashed, So, but I run Vista. Then I had everything pulled up and then everything went away, so you have to bear with me for a second. I probably should have done this before. Um, we're going to have a bad allocation. No, we're not. We're fine. Come on. Well, there's a video I made, and it was emergency update. Gun confiscation laws are coming. Um, it was Seattle. They did it first, and then they're doing it out here. They did it in Colorado since then. Granted, that was a year ago. I'll put the link in, but I'm not going to try to record it because things go bad over here when that happens. Um, but here's the thing that really gets put this together in my mind. The FBI does want to track social media for criminals and terrorists before they act. Um, FBI access social media alerting tool. Help insiders proactively and reactively monitor our terrorist groups, foreign intelligence services, blah, blah, blah. You know, it sounds kind of good. But what if they think that a terror, domestic terror threat, is caused by making a video about red flag gun laws? Then they come to your house and, you know, do all that stuff. So we're just on a crazy timetable of the society change underneath our feet. So in spite of the woes of technology, I just wanted to get back real quick and uh, tell you thanks for watching. Keep your eye on the legislation um, and do whatever you have to do to protect yourself. You're put on this planet to have a good life and enjoy your experience. And, you know, so do your best. Um, thanks for the comments also. I'll leave you with two pictures that I took. <laughs> I think that one's funny. Okay. Thanks, guys. Bye.